Hello friends I am your favorite storyteller today i will tell you about the amazing story of marvel's avengers so the story goes like this the asgardian loki encounters the other the leader of an extraterrestrial race known as the chitauri in exchange for retrieving the tesseract a powerful energy source of unknown potential the other promises loki an army with which he can subjugate earth nick fury director of the espionage agency shield arrives at a remote research facility where physicist Dr. Eric Selvig is leading a team experimenting on the tesseract the tesseract suddenly activates and opens a wormhole allowing loki to reach earth loki steals the tesseract and uses his scepter to enslave selvig and other agents including clint barton to aid him In response, Fury reactivates the Avengers initiative. Agent Natasha Romanoff heads to Kolkata to recruit Dr. Bruce Banner to trace the Tesseract through its gamma radiation emissions. Fury approaches Steve Rogers to retrieve the Tesseract, and Agent Phil Coulson visits Tony Stark to have him check Selvig's research. Loki is in Stuttgart, where Barton steals the iridium needed to stabilize the Tesseract's power. leading to a confrontation with Roger Stark and Romanoff that ends with Loki's surrender. While Loki gets escorted to Shield, his brother Thor arrives and takes him, hoping to convince him to abandon his plan and return to Asgard. Stark and Roger intervene and Loki is taken to Shield, flying aircraft carrier, the helicarrier where he is imprisoned. The Avengers become divided over how to approach Loki and the revelation that Shield plans to harness the Tesseract to develop powerful weapons as a deterrent against hostile extraterrestrials. As they argue, Loki's agents attack the helicarrier and the stress causes Banner to transform into the Hulk. Stark and Rogers work to restart the damaged engine and Thor attempts to stop the Hulk's rampage. Romanoff knocks Barton unconscious in battle and then try to help him to break Loki's mind control. Loki escapes after killing Coulson and Fury uses Coulson's sacrifice and his faith in Avengers to motivate the Avengers to work as a team. Loki uses the Tesseract and a wormhole generator Selvig built to open a wormhole above Stark Tower to the Chitauri fleet in space, launching his invasion. Rogers, Stark, Romanoff, Barton, Thor and the Hulk rally in defense of New York City and together the Avengers battle the Chitauri. The Hulk beats Loki into submission. Romanoff makes her way to the generator where Selvig, freed from Loki's mind control, reveals that Loki's scepter can shut down the generator. Fury's superiors from the World Security Council attempt to end the invasion by launching a nuclear missile at Midtown Manhattan. Stark intercepts the missile and takes it through the wormhole towards the Chitauri fleet. The missile detonates, destroying the Chitauri mothership and disabling their forces on Earth. Stark's suit loses power and he goes into free fall, but the Hulk saves him while Romanoff uses Loki's scepter to close the wormhole. In the end, Thor returns with Loki and the Tesseract to Asgard where Loki will face their justice. After this incident, everyone starts working together as a team under Shield, which is called Avengers to protect Earth and mankind from the dangerous enemies. If you love this story, then please like, share, subscribe and visit our channel. Thank you.